Bigo Braino is inside a head. Hey, head. Power of Hito Monkey. Yo. Hey, yo, guys. Welcome back. It's a yet another video of Marvel Snap. Hope you guys enjoyed the last one. It was a lot of funny moments. Um, I realized most of that video I played with the blue Marvel in the deck instead of what I swapped out for, which was Iceman. Um, so I thought I'd go into a bit more depth about the monkey deck on this video, um, since I've done the introduction for the last video, and just tell you some of my reasoning behind some of the picks. Um, the whole point of this deck is to play one cost cards and then bounce them back with Beast, make them zero cost cards. So in turn five or six, preferably six, you throw down hit monkey and then you throw down as many cards as you can and just flood the board and just catch them off guard with the amount of power you suddenly throw down. Um, there is counters to this if the enemy have um, Sandman. So usually it's like Electro Sandman ramp decks. If you want to look those up, I recommend looking on Untap GG. I'm not sponsored, unfortunately, but it helps a lot um, with looking up decks and enemy decks and maybe look up some videos for certain um, Sandman plays if you haven't got the Battle Pass. But um, for those that do, this is for you. I just want to explain a little bit. So the reason I swapped out Blue Marvel for Iceman is I wasn't getting a lot of... Um, what's the word? I wasn't getting a lot of value out of playing Blue Marvel. I felt. So the reason I like Iceman is because we play Iceman early, let's say, and we play Rocket Raccoon early. And say you predict with Rocket Raccoon, you get the power, Iceman, you make one of their cards, a one plus extra cost. Then you bounce them back, put them back in your hand. You get to play them yet again on turn five or turn six. And then boom, you get to reactivate that uh, on, uh, was it, on reveal. And Rocket Raccoon is probably my favorite for doing that because you make him plus two, you make him a four cost, bounce him back, and then correctly predict again on the last turn. He's suddenly a one to six, um, which is crazy, right? And obviously he becomes zero. Oh, he, he's a zero six technically because he's a zero cost. Um, I explained a little bit last time. I put Thor in this because I like the zero cost uh, Mjolnir for the last turn as well. It's another zero cost card. It's nice. Moon Girl is nice. Sometimes you'll end up seeing um, I have like three or four zero cost cards and then I Moon Girl it and I can end up having two hit monkeys and then you play two hit monkeys in the last turn plus a bunch of zero cost cards. You get two massive two um, cost cards which are the hit monkeys because obviously on reveal they um get stronger based on how many cards you reveal that turn so yeah and obviously in mysterio you play three cards so you play mysterio that's already plus six for hit monkey just for a two cost card so that's a bit of explaining about some of the cards i don't want to bore you guys by talking 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 about theory um hopefully it's kind of clear what i'm talking about if you guys got any questions please don't hesitate to leave comments and i hope you guys enjoyed the video it's mainly me just messing around having a bit of fun and trying to work on my tactics and trying to work on this deck so hope you guys enjoy I'm a ghost. I'm a ghost. I don't need nobody. Yeah. I'm a ghost. Long one of ghosts. Eh, rocket, raccoon, eh, 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 rocket, raccoon, eh, rocket, raccoon, eh, rocket, raccoon, eh, 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 eh. Alright, cool. As long as it's not beast, that's fine. Rocket, raccoon, eh, eh, rocket, raccoon, eh, eh, rocket, rocket, rocket. Oh. Oh, I got beast. I might just return him now. If I bounce it now, put it down. I put this down. Oh, I can't. Oh, oh. Yeah, that's fine. Because I'm gonna move Nightcrawler to mid anyway. I don't know what this guy's doing. Turn six, you can move past to this location. Let's sir. Wait, what? I can't play it. Oh, because it's not turn four. God damn it. Um. I'm just gonna save my power. He's fine, he's fine. Play Killmonger. No. Alright. He's got Killmonger though. Which is making me scared. That's actually pretty good for me. Not gonna lie. That says his base power to two. It's perfect. Nice. Yeah, he's definitely has Killmonger. Skedaddle! Get the fuck up out of there! Skedaddle! Skadoodle! Skadoodle out of there, man! Everybody, retreat! Ooh, moon girl. Moon girl. It's a moon, moon, moon girl. Killmonger. Oh, he moon girl. Why would you play it there, though? Just Reduced your power for no reason. Alright then. Um, meh, 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 meh.
Uh, boom. 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 Ooh. I hate the way that this works. Boom. Bow. Boom. 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 Monkey! One, two, three, four, five. So he gets ten extra power. I think I win. Gonna test game loading times. Let me know how it goes, GM. Let me know how it goes, my brother. It might also be because I'm streaming. Maybe I could play it without streaming. Nice, look at that. Big power. I think we still win, right? I forgot he had Killmonger. We still win even left. Oh, we win everything. The hell you doing, sir? I feel like when you make cards zero cost, then they shouldn't get destroyed by Killmonger, because technically they ain't one-cost cards anymore. Big ol' Braino is inside a hedo. Hey, hedo! The power of Hitomonkey, yo! Oh, Hitomonkey! I play a Rokita Raccoon, no! Oh, you play card over here for no reason. Oh, Blue Marvel, oh no. I'm never really playing Blue Marvel. I don't know if I should keep him in the deck. I don't really need him. Oh, it's a bistoro. I could do take the, this uh, rocket or raccoon. No, no. Oh, that's not good. We don't like. We don't like that. We don't. We don't like that. Not at all. To be honest, I could save it and use it if I had fucking hit monkey, and it'd be great. It'd be giving me a nice free zero cost for hit monkey, but no. Win. Oh, what a dickhead, bro! After I just played Dan the Widow, smart place. Smart place. You really think you're gonna win because of that? Just because of that? Get out my face, boy! Get out my face! Oh, GM, fuck off. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with my game. That's the only game I've ever had a problem with. I don't know, bro. Maybe if I reinstall it, but I can't be fucked anymore. Oh, well, shit, I realized I had to play something here. Oh, I lost there anyway. Together. Oh, wait, this is not even going to give everything back in my hand, right? I'm not going to be able to have a hand of, like, crazy amount, right? But yeah, it just gave me that back. That sucks. I mean, he's gonna play a card here, so we do that. Run, Cerebro. Oh yeah, they're all twos. Yeah, you're right, bro. In a bit, my bastard. Sorry, man. No, it's, it's fine, GM, bro. It's not your fault. I'm going to with you, bro. I don't know what's wrong, man. Maybe if I reinstall it or something like that. I think it might... Maybe it's because I'm streaming or something. Maybe it just doesn't do well with streaming. Who knows? So, Roma. Flammable. Stay back. Ooh, okay, great. Oh, but this is risky because if I get... If it swaps with Hitmonkey, I'm kind of... Actually, no, I'm not fucked because I can just beast him back if it fucks me up. Mm, okay. Hmm. If 
I hit monkey it down, if I hit monkey it down, it goes back in my deck. This is a risky play. I'm playing with I'm playing with the, the random Jesus here. I could, it would have been good actually to play it with something else and give it some extra power, then swap it back into my deck. Oh, oh, oh wait, but it doesn't do it doesn't do the disguise thing. I guess it would have been too obvious which one was which. I can get it back in my hand anyway. What am I gonna get? Oh. Hopefully, I get Thor, and I'm gonna beast it back. Mm, great. Full of the shit. <laughs> yeah, I'll check my Discord, bro. Don't worry, I believe you. I believe you, bro. <gasps> what a random card for each player, bro. <laughs> I get fucking Galactus. No way. And he's filled it up already. There's no way. I just ran. What do you mean, bro? Why are you snapping? Bro, you can't play anything. <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> bro, I it's a put a random card here. Why would he snap? Yeah, what? You snapped and then retreated. <laughs> what? Why would he snap? Did he not realize? Was he like afterwards? Oh shit, I can't play anything. <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> fucking jokes. Snap um, basically increase the amount of cubes you win or lose for each game. So if you don't, no one snaps. You only win or lose one cube. Uh, or two cubes, sorry, by the end of the game. The cubes are here. And the cubes are what contribute to your rank. So if you both snap, then the game is worth eight cubes, which is like almost a whole rank. So you snap when you're confident that you're going to win, basically. I don't know what that guy was doing, bro. That made zero sense. He literally made himself... So if he just retreated straight away, he would have lost one cube, but he snapped and then retreated, which made him lose two cubes. So weird. I could not explain to you like what the thought process was for that for that man. That was hilarious. Out of all the cards, I got a random card that gave me Galactus, and I was lucky I didn't play anything there. Big up Galactus. Okay, quantum tunnel. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, wait. What I could do is Ant-Man, put that there, and then Beast. And Ant-Man's going to swap for something, so is Beast, but we get these cards back in our hand for, like, no cost. A nice, even better. Cool. And then Beast is going to change into something else, which is great. Hopefully it bounces it back into our hand. Oh, blue mop. That's a snap right there. That is perfect, bro. Look at this. Two cards, zero, one, zero, 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 three. Okay. After each turn, cards here lose one. I don't know why, why he's put something there. If I put that there, I have a chance of getting all. Mm. This is juicy. This is very juicy. I could even wait. Because it's a one cost. Can't play that there. Where am I? Wait. I'm just gonna bishop here. Maybe playing cards in it count as two with hit monkey. Mmm. Yeah, you're right. Maybe. I doubt it though. I don't think it does. I don't think it will. I don't think it'll work like that. But I'll save a spot anyway and we can work out the maths. But I don't think it will work like that, to be honest with you. Okay, he's shurried. And forge. Oh, this next card he plays is gonna be a bit. Yo! <laughs> Should we beast it back again? Oh shit, I was gonna. Oh, wait, what if I. What if I. Boom. Bow. Boom. Bow. Boom. Oh! <laughs> Hit monkey's about to be huge on the last turn, bro. Let's go! Yo, minus one. Oh, I thought it worked like that for a second. Okay, well, mid is gonna be free. He's gonna—he's probably gonna arm him Zola in mid. 
So I don't need to do super, super crazy high power on there. So, I mean, he's going to have he's gonna have a bit of power over here. We're going to put monkey on left, because otherwise it swaps with quantum. Um, so we'll put Angela down first. Quantum monkey. Nightcrawler. And then we will moon girl and yellow jacket mid. Because we are in mid, because he's going to Arnim Zola. And we should win. I don't know. I haven't done the math. One, two, three, four. So uh, given four. He's already on what? Eight power. We should win. I think. Especially if he Arnim Zola's in mid. But it depends what he does in mid. He could. He could do something else in mid. Mm. This is going to swap. And we lose this unless we get Thor or Rocket Raccoon. I should have played Moon Girl first, but my turn's too late. Too late now. If we play Moon Girl first, then we got Bishop. It would work with the cards. Destroy our mid. You think? Oh, Rocket Raccoon. That is not good for us. Yeah, destroy our mid. You're right. We lose. We don't, we don't, we win. Let's go! The power of the monkey! Victory. The power of the monkey! I didn't, wasn't including Blue Marvel in my fucking calculations. Let's go! We double bounced the monkey back, that was nice. The bouncing monkey. Who I want Sarah so I can start fucking outplaying people. Play that early. That's true. That's true. Actually, maybe maybe I should do a, a kill manga. just lose her because I'm gonna lose anyway all the cards are worth four just bounce it back yeah I don't think I, I need to justify come on but yeah I agree Nimrod really I guess that means he wins Sanctum Santorium because of yeah but I mean really I could moon girl it gives me another hit monkey It's really a shame that Mysterio doesn't go into Sanctum Sanctorium, because then I miss out on two cards, basically. I actually don't need Mysterio in this, I don't think. Hmm. Okay, so that's it. How many cards do I play? One, two, three, four. So I have eight power. I just have eight. He plays a card here, then I win here. Uh, uh, I think I win. But heavy left. Okay. You, yeah, I agree. I agree. I agree. That's all I can really do. But if he Zola's, he's just gonna Zola Venom, so I should have gone heavy mid. Ah, uh, whatever, I can't be fucked. There's no predicting what people do nowadays, man. Okay, well I've won mid. What a weird play. Do I win left as well? I think I win left as well. Yep, nice, GG. Well, he apparently, he, this is what I'm saying, bro. He doesn't care about Mojo Ward. 
Can't predict what these people are gonna do, bro. Um, if Wolverine came over here, would I have lost? No, I still would have won. Great. Woo! That's what I'm saying, bro. It's hard to predict people. Like, what was that? If Zola Venomsy loses if we just fill four cards mid. Oh, yeah, that's true, it's true, it's true. You right, you right. When you right, you right. It's turn four, mod card. What? Wait, wait. What cost is a symbiote? If I bounce it back, what cost is it? I don't really want that, though, I guess, but. Three. It's a three cost. Okay. I'll leave it then for now. Eh. Oh, it's hit store. Okay, we play a card here, double its power. That's fine. That's great. That's a Fandabulous. Oh, we could yellow jacket mid. And it's going to double its power. I might just move this over. It's just. And we can bounce it back, get a nice zero. This could be really, really good. This Shuri's lab. A monkey. If we just need to get the right cards in our hand. Right now, it's looking okay-ish. We need some more one costs, and we need beast. And then we need hit monkey as well. Okay, so we have another one cost here. This could be good. We'll do that. I don't want to copy on my opening hand. I don't need that. Nice, he played a card here. Great. That's great. Cool. So he's going to move that away because... Why not? Move that to Clintar probably. Give himself a bit of a stronger symbiote. Nice. We've got eight power rock rocket. Perfect pro. Please give me beast, man. I need beast so badly right now. I might play Thor. Just to bounce it back as well. Please give me beast. Please give me beast. I need uh, the beast. -aru. I need beast on turn five, man. What chance do we have? We have a 20% chance of getting Beast. We need Beast. Okay. I mean, that doesn't really make sense because doesn't that disappear? What is this? Oh, it's a 4 cost. Okay. Yeah, because it got rid of your ability. Oh, I didn't get Beast, man. I could just stick Moongo in mid, just to double up, but then... Because it's my strongest card, but I could just wait till next turn. Angela, Bishop. He prof X now. Yeah, he prof X over there, probably. Yeah. Oh, he stormed it. Wind my hand. Why? It was turn 6 anyway, bro. Doesn't make any sense. Oh, now I get hit, monkey. Damn. I mean, that's all I can do, really. I don't think it's enough to win over here, though. I'm going to try bait him. I'll hit him with the happy face. I'm going to snap. Could do that. But is that even enough to win? So that brings me to two, four, so six, and this would be a two, so eight. If he plays it at four cost, I lose. Let's go. I'm not gonna snap because I'm I'm an idiot if I do. Oh, okay. Why did he not Professor X over here? Did he only just get or something. I've won. What? I mean, I won even without putting Moon Girl in mid. Didn't make any sense. I won without Moon Moon in mid. Because if I didn't play it, I still had 20 power. Didn't make any sense. Just in case he had a brain. <laughs> 
Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, if you played any decent card, made 100%. That's what we expected. But like I said, you can't expect good plays. I don't know why. But this is good. We got we got Beast and we got um, Hit Monkey in our hand. This is a really good start. Okay, he's taken out that. That's not too big of a deal. Cards here have minus one power. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to end our turn. Yeah. I think I play Bishop mid. Play Beast mid last turn. <laughs> he was like, oh, he's going to bounce it. He played Storm when he should have played Xavier. He would have won if he played Xavier on left. And then maybe... Maybe, do you know what? If he played Storm last because he had priority on mid and stopped me from Shuri doubling and then played like a card for him to double, that would have been smart, but... I don't know. I don't know. Let's not try and imagine what's going on in that man's head. If I'm Moon Girl, turn 5, I can bounce. Nah. Let's do this. Play it safe. Kind of want to put Nightcrawler down next turn as well, though. Xavier, Professor X. Yeah, Xavier. Professor Xavier. Come on, man. What's wrong with you? You should be banned from playing Marvel Snap for that comment. If I play him, but if I play Moon Girl, then... Just... What do I want to... How many cards can I play on turn 6? Play that. 1, 2... That's 2 cost. 1 cost. That's 3 cost. That's 5 cost. So I can play these 5 cards. Doop, 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 doop. So I can't play anything. Yeah, so I have 5 spaces, so let's not play Moon Girl. Well, I'm moving Nightcrawler out of the fucking way anyway. If he Odin's... I mean... What can we do? Um, What could he else could he do? He could play... Black Panther. I mean, he's definitely gonna play Sunken Mid, so let's do that. Like that, right? The Odin's, of course. Yeah. Do I have enough to win here? Four, eight, nine. No, because if he Odin's and it goes voot, voot, I just have a nine here. He's going to have ten. So, what if I put that there, that there? That there, that there. How much does this have? This might be able to win mid. Eight, you have nine. This will give me four, seven, nine, and then plus bishop strong. Oh, over here. I'm gonna play that. I think that might win me it. I mean, uh, that, what was that? <laughs> Who are we playing against today, bro? I'm going to snap. Is it too late? <laughs> Spending too much time wishing the star. Realize that you're just sitting in the dark. Home for a spark, quitting for no other shot with the arc. I ain't going to buy two I'm a cruise right by you If it's all that I do High IQ, let me prove
中。